Tell me if it but not I. He steady point who? Everybody else. Blaming everybody, everybody else. But you are the one that got what? Offended. Offended. He knew it was in Peter. He didn't, he wasn't talking about the mother disciple. He was talk, trying to get Peter to see Peter. Amen. Some of us don't want to see ourselves. Amen. I know when people come talking to me, I don't get in your face. I don't get in your face. I don't sit in there. I own my mind. But when you open the door for me to get in there, and I'll tell you what, I, uh, what the Lord gave me to say, a lot of people get offended. You knew you didn't want to hear from the beginning. So why are you coming at? Amen. <laughs> come on. Come on. <laughs> Something I don't want to hear, but I'm going at you anyway. Sometimes she says something to me, and she won't say that until I say something. <laughs> huh? That's true. Did she hit me? I just. <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead and swallow it. It bothered me. It bothered the flag. But. She was right. Amen. Let's start with me. <laughs> she right. Something I'm gonna do. She said, I would and she said, Well, I'm gonna stay out there. I'm gonna stay out there. She said, I stay out of it. Then when I go pray again, I came to my senses. Y'all, 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 I was in what? Denial. Come on, y'all, 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 will y'all come out of denial? Please come out. Hey. Come out, come out. <laughs> Don't put. Hey. If it were for him. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. He's trying to get you to come out of denial and release it to him. This way he was telling me, Peter, I want you to come out of denial. So when I get off the earth, you're not, I'm not there to defend you in the natural. But I can't defend you in the spirit. And this is what Jesus said. I can't defend you in the natural. But I can defend you in the spirit. But if you in denial, I can't defend you. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Because we carry the problem. Right. Amen. Him, Jesus. Mm. I ain't holding all the way on it. Just a TV. <laughs> Him, <Here>, Jesus. <laughs> Jesus, reach and get it. Mm hmm. Yeah, Jesus. <laughs> Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Jesus, and you still hold this love. Yeah. That's it. Denied. You denied yourself saying you gave it to me. Come on. That's good. You denied yourself. Yeah. I'm gonna let that sink on me mm -hmm. before I start back talking. Mm -hmm. Are you listening? Amen. Thank you, Jesus. All right. Mm -hmm. All right. Come on, man. And Jesus said unto him, Verily I say unto thee, that this day, even in this night, before the cock crow twice, thou shalt deny me thrice. Okay, I want you to see something. He said, Verily I, verily I say unto thee, that this day, this day, it didn't wait three or four weeks. Mm -hmm. He said, This day. This day. Mm -hmm. So the day, day is Sunday. October 
What day? Tonight? October 9th. This day. He said, I done told you, Peter's is in denial. This day, you're going to deny what I said. Some of y'all going to walk right out of here <laughs> and to never what I said and still walk around right here with your head between your legs. Holla, I'm you. This day, today, <laughs> today, I guarantee you ain't taking it. You hearing it, but you're not taking it. Instead of you taking it and putting it inside of your heart, you send it on top of it. Peter saw the law of God, word, Jesus' word, on top of his heart. It wasn't in his heart. And so that's what's wrong with a lot of us. Amen. This thing. This thing. You're going to walk out here with that same mentality that you came in here with. Because you won't admit. That you have offense. Mm -hmm. You weak in some area. Mm -hmm. You in denial. This day he said, today, October 8th, you could write that in your Bible if you want to. Mm -hmm. October 8th, I'm not going to be in no denial. Mm -hmm. Tell yourself that. <laughs> I ain't going to be in the night. If that's what it is, it's just what it is. I'm not going to close my eyes. I'm, I'm not going to be in denial of it. Come on, y'all. We got to come out of this. Yes, thank you, Jesus. For you to get what God, what you really want, you got to come out of the night. He said this day, and then, boy, he said, this day, even in this night. So that means I'm going to carry that thing over in there. Yeah. <laughs> mm. The crows, and the uh, chicken ain't crow yet. What he said, before what? The cock crow, crow twice. Thou shalt not deny me thrice. Mm. Mm -hmm. Come on. But he spake the morning vehemently. If I should die with thee, I will not deny thee in any wise. Likewise also said they all. Now, okay, Peter attitude changed when Jesus kept saying that. He got mad. <laughs> he got mad with Jesus when Jesus kept saying that you are in denial. Yeah. Some of y'all man. Yeah. I'm sick. I'm sick. I'm sick. And I'm going to keep on preaching to you. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. One word. He got upset. He got mad with Jesus because Jesus kept telling him, What's about you? This is what's wrong with the body today, Lena. Why some of us so messed up? People would not tell us the truth. And then when they start telling you the truth, you get mad. You get mad. And still, oh yes. That's me. Amen. It hit me. That man hit me. Yeah. That woman hit me. I took my hit and kept on ticking. Amen. <laughs> Thank you. Next thing I know, Lena, I was on the floor. Yeah. Last night, I think I laid on the floor. I, I know 15 or 20 minutes. Yeah. Yeah. When I tried to get up with the camera, the Lord put me right back down there. I knew then I needed something from God. When I got up there more, I feel a whole stuff fell off me. Amen. 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 Come on now. Amen. It was a blessing for me. See that I wasn't in denial. I ain't been told out like that in the hand of God. No when you like to head up under the north, you know. <laughs> <laughs> that boy hit me out those down. Wow. Bam. I was out. Because I needed that. God knew what I needed. I was in denial. So I don't 
think what's going on with me in the wilderness that I'm going to let it stop me. Some of y'all just done stop. Just stop. Stop functioning. Looking pretty, but you ain't functioning. Wear all that makeup with your tutu on your head. <laughs> Fake grin. But inside of you ain't. You up there, you weak. Come on. I'm being real. Amen. All right, Liz, come on in. And they came to a place which was named Gethsemane. Mm -hmm. And he said to his disciples, Sit ye here while I shall pray. Mm -hmm. And he take it with him Peter and James and John, and begin to be sore amazed and to be very heavy, mm -hmm. and said unto them, My soul is exceeding sorrowful unto death, tarry ye there, tarry ye here, and watch. And he went forward a little and fell on the ground, and prayed that, if it were possible, the hour might pass from him. And he said, Abba, Father, all things are possible unto thee. Take away this cup from me. Nevertheless, not what I will, but what thou wilt. Mm -hmm. And he cometh and findeth them sleeping, and said unto Peter, Simon, sleepest thou? Couldest not thou watch one hour? Mm -hmm. Watch ye and pray, lest she enter into temptation. The spirit truly is ready, but the flesh is weak. The spirit what? Is yeah, truly ready. ready. The spirit always is ready. The spirit always ready to defend you, ready to cover you, but your flesh is weak. So what you do, you don't depend on the spirit. You depend more on the flesh. And the flesh is weak, but the spirit is always ready. It's ready to intercede. It's ready to get in the way. It's ready to cover you. It's always ready. That's what Jesus was trying to tell Peter. Get out of the night. I'm always ready to be there. I ain't there in the flesh, but I'm there in the spirit. Amen. I'm ready. Y'all get that? Mm -hmm. Now which one ready more? The flesh is weak. That means you law okay on that day. What's up with me? Nobody gonna talk to me. <laughs> Yesterday I was gonna cut some bread. I couldn't get that gas tank to that thing to pull that gas out and it was here. I think I picked it up by five times. You know what I did? The flesh was weak. You know what I did with? Flesh is weak. I took that thing. But the spirit was really, but the flesh was weak. I put that stuff back in the garage and took, shut the door and went in the room. I said, all right, get to the next day. Come. Amen. I y'all, what you At the time, I was willing, the flesh, the spirit was willing, but my flesh was willing. Mm -hmm. So by me being weak in the flesh, I didn't finish what I come to do. Now what you mean by that, Pastor? <laughs> you can have a willing spirit to do something. Your spirit is willing. But your flesh is weak. If you can't get it one time, you kind of look at it. You can't do it two times, you throw it on the side. 
you put it down and leave it what? Alone. Alone. But it's still to deal with. So if I'm in denial, I should have asked the spirit to lead me to somebody to help me. But in my flesh, come on, I didn't ask the Holy Spirit to lead me or help me. I did in my flesh. So what I did, I did do but pile it up. Oh, but did I make sense out of that? See, he, the fear is willing. He's ready to help you. But if you put it down in the now, later, my grass still ain't cut. Amen. And the gas in the, in the thing. But if I had a not yield to my flesh, but yield to the spirit, the Lord already had me around. Uh -huh. But if my flesh said, go on in the house. Uh -huh. Well, I need another drink. <laughs> <laughs> Get your arms on. Come on. I hope I'm happy. I hope I'm saying today. I want y'all. I don't know about getting denied. Y'all don't call me that. <laughs> All right, don't call me. <laughs> I ain't telling no lie because I don't want it. Amen. Okay, that's all that. I want you to stay right there. And Okay, I want you to stay in Mark 14. I want to get 27 to 29. I'm going to show you this. Okay, stay right where you are. I want you to go back over here to 27 and to 29. I want you to read these sentences again. And Jesus said unto them, All ye shall be offended because of me this night. For it is written, I will smite the shepherd, and the sheep shall be scattered. But after that I am risen, I will go before you into Galilee. But Peter said unto him, Although all shall be offended, yet will not I. And Jesus said unto him, Verily I say unto thee, That this day, even in this night, before the cock crow twice, Thou shalt deny me thrice. So he telling y'all, he know what y'all gonna do when y'all mm -hmm. leave him. <laughs> deny. <laughs> you gonna deny. Yeah, mm -hmm. God, come on. I'm gonna hurry. I won't get y'all holding, all right? I'm about to. But he spake the more vehemently. If I should die with thee, I would not deny thee in any wise. Likewise also said they all. Mm -hmm. And they came to a place which was named Gethsemane. And he said to his disciples, Sit ye here while I shall pray. Mm -hmm. And he take it with him Peter and James and John, and begin to be sore amazed and to be very heavy. Mm. And so Jesus right now, he is so what? Amazed and so heavy. He's in that type of condition right now. Because of how we are in yeah. denial. Mm -hmm. And y'all think y'all here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> he's, he's heavy. He's, in, he's weighted down with the sorrow of people that say they believe in him. And we don't what? We walk in what? Denial. Denial. It bothered him. That you don't believe what he said. That bothered him with Peter. He kept telling Peter the truth. And Peter did, kept denying that he was not like that. If the word said you like that and he hit you, you like that. Come on. My God, I ain't going to get mad and run off somewhere because I, you know, hurt my feeling. To me, yeah, my feeling hurt, but it's making me. Amen. 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 Mm -hmm. Ooh, my glory to God. Let's go to Luke 22. I'm about to, yeah. Luke 22. Mm -hmm. 22, 
from 23 to 34. This is just mainly, I got one more after that. You know, I'm doing good. I'm going to get y'all back in here. 20, Luke 22, 23 to 34. Look what he said. I'm going to show you. I'm going to break this for you. Let me show you. And they began to inquire. Luke 22. Luke 22, start at verse 20. Okay, I will write need to go. I want you to go back up. Get 22 first for Luke 22. I didn't have it on the paper. And truly the Son of Man goeth, as it was determined. But woe unto that man by whom he is betrayed. Okay, time I'm not going down to 22. And they begin to inquire among themselves which of them it was that should do this thing. Mm -hmm. Come on. Come on, Judas. All right, come on. And there was also a strife among them, which of them should be accounted the greatest. Mm -hmm. And he said unto them, The kings of the Gentiles exercise lordship over them, and they that exercise authority upon them are called benefactors. Mm -hmm. But ye shall not be so. But he that is greatest among you, let him be as the younger, and he that is chief as he that doeth serve. So he was trying to get Peter to change his character. Now y'all see that? See the character? This is what Jesus was trying to get Peter to realize. Your character got to change. To be over something of mine, your character got to Change. You see people over stuff? Mm -hmm. Their character having what? Change. Change. That's right. Their character was nothing like Jesus. Mm -hmm. Peter's character was what? Offense. His character was to fight. Jesus was not a what? <laughs> Jesus was not a fight. So Jesus tried to change your character before he released something to you. I'm a new man. I didn't choose to be a pastor. Mm -hmm. I didn't choose to be over God's stuff. Mm -hmm. So he had to what? Change my character so I look more like him than look like Sarah mm -hmm. Lee. Some of us don't want our character to what? Change. Some of us want to look pitiful all the time. That's mm -hmm. right. That's true. So if he's going to put you over something, your character got to change. Amen. This is what he's saying. I'm changing Peter's character. Some of us got some nasty character. Right. So he's trying to change your character. Oh Lord, I hope those on TV broadcast, you need to write to me. <laughs> <laughs> this is what he's saying. I realize I standing up on this before I brought it for y'all. He wants your character to change. If you gonna represent him, he don't want to see you to be seen more flesh. He wants to see more of him, not by his spirit. Mm -hmm. All right, come on. Man. For whether is greater, he that sitteth at me, or he that serves, is not he that sitteth at me, but I am among you as he that serves. Okay, Jesus will let them know. Is not you to be served, you to serve. Mm -hmm. Jesus was saying, I'm among you, but I'm serving you. They didn't serve Jesus, Jesus served them. This is what he's trying to get them to realize. You take my character, it ain't about you. Mm -hmm. It's about me. Y'all got real quiet. Mm -hmm. Real quiet. Something you want to do, you can't do. 
Some folk you want to bless out, mm-hmm. you can't bless out. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Thank you, That's true. Because you are representing him. So he's telling you, you got a fence in you. You're weak. So I need to build your character so you will not see more of Lena than me. Okay. Okay. She put on a show. Now, she put the actor, she the star. Instead of me following her, she we on TV, instead of me following her, she doing the act. I'm gonna drop in front of her. Oh. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah. I'm dropping in front of her, yeah. But it's about her. Is that making sense? Mm-hmm. This is what Jesus saying. You serving me. So you don't jump in front of me. <laughs> so I got to change your. Yeah. Don't you, Peter, got married with Jesus, didn't he? Uh-huh. Didn't I tell you I? <laughs> <laughs> That's where it is in the church, bro. I'm the pastor for everybody else. Mm-hmm. Pastor me. Uh-huh. <laughs> Yeah. He changing your character. Don't you want your character to change? Yes. Mm-hmm. Yes, Lord. Yes. So this is what he doing. He trying to get you to realize it ain't about you. Mm-hmm. I hurt my feelings. That's all right. He trying to get your feelings intact. So it won't bother you when they hurt your feelings. You That's still serve me. Thank you, Jesus. Thank Amen. you. Amen. They, they ain't talking about me. I ain't going to that church no more. I ain't going to. You ain't going to stop going to church. Right. Then you will not stop doing because somebody else tells you don't do it. That's right. Mm-hmm. Your character. Amen. 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 Thank you, Jesus. Y'all been quiet and quiet. I'm just bored this time. Uh, this mess ain't hitting on nothing with y'all. Uh, y'all real mad. I'm happy. And I got the message over. All right. All right, let me finish up. Come on. Ye are they which have continued with me in my temptation. See, they could, you got the what? Continue. The twelve, but the only one continued with him. But they had those Peter was the main one that he needed to build a foundation upon. So some of y'all's in here gonna continue with me Amen. through my temptation. I'm in my willingness. Amen. So you are continuing with me. All right. Look what else it says. And I appoint unto you a kingdom, as my Father have appointed it unto me. So God going to start upon it. When you get all this, see, this is where people mess up at. This is what Jesus is saying. Now, Peter, once you get all this out of you, my Father going to appoint you. Just like the Father appointed him. When you can control your emotions, then I can use you. When you sit in the church, you ain't doing everything that, and not paying attention to the pastor, then I can't appoint you. That's right. When some people messing with the, uh, what you call them, phone? Cell phone, texting. Amen. Come on, y'all. Amen. See, y'all hate to tell the truth. Amen. <laughs> When you ain't paying attention, he said, I'm watching now. I can't use you. Amen. Amen. Thank, you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. He's watching you yes. when you sitting up in church. Yep. He know when you ain't paying no attention. Yep. So I can't appoint you. Mm-hmm. That's the word. Is I'm lying. Ain't that in the word? Yes. You can't do a work if I don't get something. If you so caught up with computer stuff and stuff of the world, I can't use you. Come on, I see.